synopsis by my partner Stuart Robson. And on the menu, action from Europe's Premier Club competition, the Champions League. This the first leg of the semi-final. It's the lads, and they take on Milan. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. This attack looks highly promising. Leal. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Esposito. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make oh, an Oh, he's argument. in behind them here, Derek. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Evans. Routine, really. Well, it's a good move in the making from the lads. Now, will the cross work out for them? Now, well, sadly, too straight to worry the goalkeeper that time.
And Milan moving the ball with purpose. Poor pass under no real pressure. How can he take them on and beat them? Very quick thinking there. Delgado with it. Firing it in. It has to be. Oh, body in the way, crucially. It is to be a throw in. Could play it in. High quality defending. Wonderfully weighted pass. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Oh, did so well to deny him. Who's going to get on the end of it? On a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. This looks threatening. He had to score. And he does. So the ball is moving again. Will there be a quick response from the lads? There needs to be. Jude Bellingham and unable to keep possession Sebastiano Esposito opportunity to deliver the cross firing at George Jones and just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. And slipped through beautifully. Can he finish this? Oh, good work by the keeper. Trying to pick out a teammate. Goalkeeper's ball. It was always going to be that way. Promising looking ball. Oh, could be. And not cleared away properly. Well, just look at this. Magnificent agility, perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. So the ball is rolling again at one all. And Milan could get in behind the defence. Machado and the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks we're at the end of 45 minutes in this game we certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point Stuart well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal. Because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Oh, 
handled it so well to deny him. This looks threatening. He had to score, and he does. Firing it towards goal. And just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. Can he finish this? Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Possession lost. Plenty of support here. Fabian. Well, a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. Taken short. Tomori. Now with Fabian. And now Rodrigo. The cross is on. Can he give them the lead? And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Delivering it. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Now we have a plethora of live matches coming up for you here on EA TV. This one, I think, might pique your curiosity. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Still passing it around with authority. And there is the goal! He's found the net! Joy unconfined! Well, just look at this again. Great technique, good accuracy, and enough power to beat the keeper. That's an excellent goal. Well, after that setback, let's see if Milan can come up with an effective response. Rafael Leao. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. And Bellingham. Delgado. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Good technique displayed. 
Pretty simple for the keeper. Good physical play. Rodrigo. Here's Fabian. Leal. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Now Delgado. An awful lot of green space to run into. And let's give credit to the defending. It's got to be! What a block! Played over. Security. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So they get the ball moving again. 3 1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? And a tidy ball. Difficult to stop him. And credit is due for... that good piece of defending and he read it well gives it a go there it is a goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round number 17 well, the ball is running again palpable sense of belief in the Milan camp hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them Evans Nash Machado Kobel Giorgio Scalvini Well, what an atmosphere we've got inside this stadium. These supporters are doing everything they can to get their team over the finish line. Sloppy in possession from the lads.
time and the scoreline working against Milan, but they're not out of it. Teo Hernandez. Ludovic Blas. There's a slide draw pass. Must be. Well, it's the late show. And they are level again. Back underway and quite the story being written in this one. 3 all. And beating the defender. Level pegging, but can they change that? Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. And Milan will get the throw-in. Well, oh, that's a completely wasted throw-in. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Blas. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. And tremendous individual skill. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Gives it a go. Body on the line. And there goes the final whistle. Well, we had goals, we had entertainment. This looks threatening. tiempo le hago caso al corazón y pasan los días los meses pensando en tu ha llegado el tiempo para usar la razón antes que se tarde sin que
Can't put out, carve your name into those shining stars. He said, Go venture far beyond the shores. Don't forsake this life of yours. I'll guide you home no matter where you are. One day, my father, he told me, Son, don't let it slip away. When I was just a kid, I heard him say, When you get older, you wild heart will live for younger days. Thinking it's never your face. He said, One day. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's the lads up against Tottenham Hotspur. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And the contest begins... Can he make it 1-0? And a timely penalty save! And he read it well, intercepting it.
Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Oh, could be a chance. A goal! The up. Well, that's one for them to pursue. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Nicely blocked. Well, nicely cut out. This now, what can they do? With the birthday, Jay. Celebrating your birthday. Happy birthday, Jay, to all of your friends. Tremendous ball played through. And a goal! Real excitement here. The equaliser. I'm hearing someone has scored in the Leicester game. Alex Scott has the news. It's his second goal for Manchester City. It's all level again at 2-2 with 77 minutes play. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Can he get them in front? Real chance. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Crossing opportunity. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way. Sometimes, some days it's rose tinted, but I think it is required. 